This man is our greatest treasure. 75 years ago this year, he started in the entertainment business. 65 years ago, he became a member of the Grand Ole Opry. And in three months and two days, he will celebrate his 93rd birthday. He's a member of the Country Music Hall of Fame. Here's little Jimmy Dickens, ladies and gentlemen. And it's a standing ovation here tonight at the Opry House for little Jimmy Dickens. I asked Jimmy backstage, I said, do you want to bring the stool out? I said, you've been having to look up at me all these years. I can get down here and look up at you. Well, I'm so short every time I pull my socks up, I blindfold myself. That's pretty short. It's pretty short. You know, I, you've, I, you've been under the weather, but we've been asking for prayers for you on a daily basis on WSM. You've got people that are praying for you all over the world, and you've just got a multitude of cards, haven't telling you? Telling me, I, I tell you, I, I want to take this, uh, t thank all these people for what they've done for me. That little prayer that you said for me went a long ways. It went a long ways, and I want to thank each and every one of you who took that moment or that two minutes or whatever it took you to send me that card and the prayers that went up to the Lord Jesus Christ. Thank you for your kindness, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you. Jimmy, I want to put these people on the honor system and tell them not to stop because it's working, isn't it? Oh, my. Uh, I can't explain. And uh, until you've gone through uh, what I've been through for the past uh, few months, uh, it, you, you come to a place to where you can't explain how you feel to people and without a teardrop or, or a heartbeat. Uh, I just don't know how to do it. And, and I can... Uh, know how people feel that uh, when they give up on you, when the doctors give up on you. I don't know. But one thing that can stop that, and that's up there. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Jimmy, we've not given up on you, and you came to the Opry 65 years ago as a member, and you're here tonight because you wanted to come out and see the folks that are going to become the newest members tonight, and that's the Old Crow Medicine Show. There, what How I about got. that? Uh, the Old Crow Medicine Show. These are professional people. They've been here with us before, yeah. and they left their mark, and they do it wherever they go. They, they come and they go around the country all over everywhere and where they go they leave a mark because they do things on their show that people have forgotten about and it brings back uh, a, a love uh, you can feel it on the stage when they come out to entertain they, they learned a lot from watching you because you're obviously the same way jimmy we appreciate you coming tonight thank you for making time for us god bless you sir May you have many, many more years in this business, and we look forward to you coming back and being on the stage with us again real soon. Let me thank you. Let me thank you, ladies and gentlemen, from the depths of my heart. And this comes from my missus, Mrs. Dickens. She's played a great part in me being here tonight. Thank you for your kindness. God bless you. Little Jimmy Dickens, ladies and gentlemen. Standing ovation tonight, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, my old dear friend, uh, Grandpa Jones, he made this particular song uh, uh, popular on Hee Haw, and this song was written by a drinking uncle. 
that I had one time. He, he's not around anymore. Whiskey and women killed him. Got to where he couldn't get neither one, so he just laid down and died, you know, and give it. <laughs> down the road here from me, there's an old holler tree where he lay down a dollar two. And you go around the field and you come back again with a jug full of good old Mountain Dew. Here they go, that good old Mountain Dew. I am a shirt a month if you fill up the jug with that good old mountain dew. Still on the hill where it runs off a gallon or two. And the buzzards in the sky get to drop the cake light from smelling that good old Mountain Dew. Yeah, the boy, that good old Mountain Dew. And them that refuse it on me. I'll shut my if you fill up my jug with that good old and my uncle Nord thought he saw it off in short and he measures about four feet too. But he thinks he's a giant when you give him a fight of that good old Mountain Dew. Yeah, they call it that good old Mountain Dew. And they might refuse it of you. I'll hush my mind if you fill up my jug with that good old Mountain Dew. Yeah, that good old Mountain Dew. Thank you.